Hello light travellers, today we're taking a look at the Woolen Prince Button Down Oxford, which is a 100% merino wool shirt. It's made from an 18.5 micron thickness merino, which means that the shirt is not quite as soft as some of the others on the market but it definitely feels nice and durable in the hand. It's made from a fairly light merino wool at only 130 GSM compared to a more preferred 200 GSM which Outlier uses. Although it's worth noting that wool and prints also do make a twill merino shirt at 170 GSM, but unfortunately it's only available in black. The wool in this shirt feels a little bit thin at first, but it is quite durable and tightly woven. As you can see here, the water actually beads off it because of how tightly woven the fabric is. Due to the relative thinness of this shirt, it's quite well suited for warmer climates, although being merino wool, it also keep you warm when it's cold outside. Unfortunately, the button placement on the wool and prints shirts is something that I'm not really a fan of. As you can see here, compared to the outlier shirt, the buttons on the wool and prints shirt are much further spaced apart. This means that you'll have an awkwardly placed button at the bottom of your shirt, and also, if the sizing is not 100% right, it does kind of tend to pull at the waist a little bit. Usually I wear a size extra small, but due to the button placement on wool and print shirts, I actually sized up to a small and got it tailored a little bit. This is because the extra small pulled slightly at the waist, causing it to bunch up in an awkward and unappealing way as you can see here. So this is the small non-tailored version, and this is the small tailored version. So for sizing I would suggest that you get your outlier size, but if you're not certain, probably size up and then get it tailored. Although it is worth noting that Wool and Prince have just announced that they're going to be offering a traditional fit, although currently only available in the blue Oxford. Wool and Prince suggest getting the shirt dry cleaned, however I've found that throwing it in the washing machine on a regular cycle caused no problems to the shirt, and also the shirt didn't shrink at all either. Finally, the price of the shirt at 128 US dollars, or 182 Australian, is quite reasonable for a 100% merino wool t-shirt, especially if you compare it to some of the other merino wool t-shirts on the market. Overall, I'd say that if you're in the market for a 100% merino wool button-up shirt, definitely go ahead and check out what wool and prints have to offer. So that's it, thanks very much for watching. Be sure to let me know in the comments what kind of merino wool button-up shirts you have or would like, and be sure to tune in for the next video.